All right, we're on the uh, Chain of Rocks Bridge. So this is a, um, a part of the Mississippi River that has basically got a whole heap of rocks in it. Um, they built a, a, a channel for the ships to get past the Chain of Rocks, but this bridge is the old bridge that used to span uh, the Chain of Rocks over the Mississippi from uh, Illinois to Missouri. Uh, so yeah, let's go have a look and check it out. It's about uh, 1.6 kilometers long or about a mile long. Um, and of course it's no longer used, so it's part of a, uh, a walking trail. We are on the way. It's part of the old Route 66 um, uh, route, so you know if you're doing the Route 66, then this is one of the places you want to come and have a look at. So let's go have a look. All right, so behind me is the state of Illinois. Over this side is Missouri. Because this here is the Mississippi River. Now the Chain of Rocks Bridge, it's got an interesting thing. Halfway across, it actually changes direction. Now that's because it was found that when they were building it, the um, the bed of the Mississippi um, wasn't able to support the weight of the bridge. So they had to do a turn to keep it on the, um, the foundations on the rocks. And of course the Chain of Rocks Bridge has been replaced by a new bridge, uh, which is part of the interstate system. There's these two little buildings down here in the middle of the water. I uh, don't know what they are. I'm going to go back, I'm going to research that, find out what they are. Um, obviously it'll be something to do with navigation, I would think. Um, and of course they would have been uh, become uh, superfluous once they dug the, uh, dug the canal. So yeah, we'll find out what they are and I'll stick a, stick a note up on the screen. I don't know, but I've just seen a, um, a sign down there, which is right in line with those buildings. So I'm picking that that sign is going to tell us what they are for. So let's go have a look. All right, these signs had absolutely nothing to do with those buildings. They are all about the animals and bits and pieces around the place. It tells a little bit about the Mississippi. All right, this is the 22 degree bend. Um, so, yeah, very impressive for 1922, which is when it was built. Um, and a very nice bridge, very worthwhile coming down and having a look at uh, if you're into, you know, old architecture and, and old things. The 22 degree bend is somewhat more uh, visible from this angle. Uh, on the downslope to the uh, Missouri side. 